Good afternoon everyone, I hope you are all having a wonderful time. So I just arrived to Phuket and exactly Patong and it's sunset time. This is the best time to show you around and see if everything is been changing to better in this city. So we are going to walk toward the beach and along the way to show you what is the real situation nowadays in Patok. So it will be very interesting vlog because this is the best time to show you around. So let's walk and talk. So guys, if you are wondering where I am exactly, I am walking from Holiday Inn towards Bangala Road and from there we are going to walk toward the beach. I hope we can catch the sunset, but as you see, things are changing in Phuket for better and most of the shops are back. So all in all, from the first impression, Phuket is getting better. As you see now, it's around 6 and it seems so busy, too many motorbikes and most of the massage shops are back guys there are massage shops in Phuket more than 7-eleven so wherever you look you will see a massage shops in Phuket today's vlog is about to show you a little bit around and you can see how is Phuket and exactly Patong is doing these days after the test and go is back till now i can see that patong is getting better some of the action is back most of the shops are reopened and that's a good thing especially the restaurants now you can come and enjoy massage shops restaurants the tour operators are also back, so if you want to take tours we're gonna check the tours later and see what are the tours that are available nowadays. I want to visit Maya Bay after the reopening and hopefully we can catch it tomorrow because I'm staying here for one week. As you see also the street vendors are back. Now we are around Amata Resort. This is one of the good resorts if you want to stay affordable and good location i'm sure lots of you know about this area that i'm walking and talking lots of motorbikes in phuket not only in bangkok but phuket is more famous wherever you see there are motorbikes and you have to be very careful while you are walking this is sleep with me the hotel it's also so famous good i was checking the prices nowadays in average they are from 25 to 50 dollars if you want to stay in this area but if you want more luxury hotels you can stay at the hills you have lots of five star hotels we are going to make a review about one of them soon which is five star and so beautiful I hope you can catch it also I'm gonna make a review about a hotel that is only $12 that I'm staying now just for one night to make a review about Patong that was the reason to book that hotel but I'm gonna make a review about that hotel too so if you want to see very affordable hotels in the area you can see so tourists now can enjoy their time here last time i made a review about this place was a ghost town but now it's much more better we are heading now toward junk Ceylon. let's see if this mall is open because it was closed last time also the tuk-tuk drivers are back one of the annoying things in patong and they charge you more than taxis so if you want to transport in patong always be careful Transportation in Patong is one of the most expensive things because it's always expensive. So this is Junk Ceylon. So here we are. The Starbucks, I think still closed because these tables are not for Starbucks. And Junk Ceylon seems it's still closed. There are some shopping is going on, but has nothing to do with Junk Ceylon. I guess 
Yes, what I'm saying that Jiang Xilong is still closed, that's for sure. So the Jiang Xilong is closed and also the coffee club is closed, the Starbucks is closed. So that was the information about this famous mall. Now let's continue walking. So as you see, we came from that side, which was Amata Resort. And now we are walking toward Bangala Road, the famous Bangala Road. The tuk-tuks are here waiting for you. But the good thing is that Patong is back a little bit to action. We're gonna see what's happening inside Bangala Road. So the music is loud and that's Red Hot also is back, one of my favorite places to sit and drink and listen to live music. So that's Soy San Sabai, one of the famous soys in the area. The music is loud, I hope my voice is clear. And here we are at Patong Beach, Phuket, Thailand walking street. So here we are at the walking street. It's 6 and 10 minutes. Hello, Tattoo. Can you visit my office, Tattoo? Uh, later, later. Thank you so much. So, this is Bangala Walking Street. And as you see, things are not bad. Although it's not late, but it's the best time to show you around. It's sunset time. We're gonna cover up the nightlife, of course, and check what's happening after 10 p.m. But now, in general, I hope you are enjoying this vlog. This is Tiger. The Tiger is back. And the girls are all wearing red because, as I said, Chinese New Year. This is New York Club. Also like Red Hot. But I prefer Red Hot. It's, it's more classical. Let's continue walking. Lots of people on service today. Oh my God. I think there are people serving more than the tourists, as you see in the picture. So we are here today at Patong to make a review and to show you what's going on, really. Is it good? Is it bad? Is everything better? Yup, it's better, but... I don't see too much tourists. We'll check after 10. The music is super loud. I don't know if my voice is clear. I'm using my external microphone. So, what do you think? Hello. Uh, thank you. Let's continue walking. I'm trying to show you as much as I can. Now we are heading toward the beach and I hope we can catch the sunset. It's not only about this walking street. Here the girls are wearing a blue. So which color you like? Red, blue or green? Choose the one you like and enjoy some drinks. Really things has changed in Patong. Now it's better. Last time I have made a review about this place, it was miserable. We're gonna try to come here after 10 p.m. and have a drink and see the real situation of the nightlife. Let me turn around and show you in general. This is it. This is Bangala Road, Walking Street, and soon Chinese New Year and Valentine. So things are getting better if you want to come to Thailand and especially if you are coming to Phuket and Patong, known for its nightlife. As I said, I'm gonna cover up the nightlife later, but this is a general idea and we are lucky to catch the sunset. This is the beach road and also here you have most of the shops are back on track. Tuk-tuks, massage parlors, tour operators. 
I can't believe last time I was walking here, it was like, oh my God, depression. Everything is closed. Let's go and check what's happening in Patong Beach. It seems there are some action. People are doing some sport and dancing at the beach. We're gonna try to cross the road. You're lucky to see all this action. And if you're not subscribed to our channel, Live Love Thailand, go for it. So the girls are shaping up. Well, my friends, as you see, lots of action is happening here these days in Patong and that was a good exercising show. I hope you enjoyed it. So now I'm gonna show you a little bit around the beach and you will see that we've missed the sunset. Well, maybe another time we can catch it, but I'm gonna show you a little bit and I'm sure you will enjoy these views from Patong Beach. So let's show you around a little bit and continue our today's vlog. Well, as I said, we've missed the sunset, but still beautiful to show you around. And there are some people enjoying the sunset, walking at the beach. This is Patong Beach. Last time I have walked at this beach, I was alone. There was no one. But now there are some tourists and it seems that test and go and Phuket Sandbox is attracting some people to enjoy these beautiful shores. We have started our today's vlog from main road of Patong and lots of shops are back on track, the massage shops, the tour operators, the tuk-tuks, the restaurants. So if you come, you will enjoy all these things. After that, we have covered Bangala Road and it's still early but lots of people enjoying some cold beers, good music, live music. There are lots of new places. And also from the beginning of Patong Beach, there were some action. People are dancing, having fun, music, sports all together. And now we are here to show you a little bit Patong at sunset. So I hope the pictures are clear. My voice is clear now, there is no music, we can speak and walk in this beautiful place. It's really nice to be here at this time, the weather is fantastic, it's not hot, it's a little bit breezy and this is Patong Beach. So guys, what do you think in general? The pictures are changed in Patong. Things are getting better. Last time I was telling you, don't come. Everything is empty, deserted. Now I'm telling you that things are better. And it's really nice to be here in Phuket, Patong, because it's not too much busy. You can enjoy everything you saw. And moreover, the weather nowadays is fantastic in Phuket. It's high season, you can swim, can walk at the beach, you can enjoy the nightlife and everything you saw along the vlog. So this was a general idea about Phuket and Patong exactly. I'm gonna review a couple of hotels. So if you want to come and enjoy test and go in Phuket, so keep in touch on the channel. There will be luxury hotels, there will be budget hotels. And also I'm gonna review the nightlife and some other things that might interest you. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned and subscribe for more from Live Love Thailand.